guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is Okore Peace Chidima welcome to Cheese Kitchen how are you doing today i'm going to be taking you a new recipe on how to prepare chicken curry sauce you know everybody has a method they use in preparing chicken curry sauce today i'm going to be using potato flour to thicken my chicken curry sauce if you cannot get cassava flour to thicken your chicken curry sauce you can use potato flour it's really really nice bet me if you try that at home so don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like don't forget to share don't forget to leave a comment below if you try this my recipe and don't forget to give me a thumbs up let's go there as i introduce all the items i'm going to bread this my chicken curry sauce let's go there guys welcome back to my youtube channel these are all the ingredients i'm going to use it to prepare this curry chicken curry sauce today i have my minced veg boneless chicken i have chicken thyme curry every seasoning i'm using two nut cubes salt spring onions red onions ginger garlic turmeric and nutmeg i'm using granite as well and pepper and i'm using potato flour to thicken my chicken curry sauce if you cannot get cassava flour you can use potato flour as well it's good it's really really nice please stay tuned as i take you to the process on how to prepare chicken curry sauce bit by bit let's go there i have to boil the chicken i'm going to be using for this chicken curry sauce so we are going to leave it to boil for like 10 minutes stay tuned so right now i'm garnishing my boneless chicken i've added salt ginger and garlic inside Time curry I've added my ghee inside as well turmeric pepper So right now we are going to leave it. The pepper is optional, you know. It's optional. If you like, you can add pepper to it when you are spicing it up. So right now we are going to cover it up for like 10 minutes. So let's go and prepare the rest of the ingredients for my chicken curry sauce. Stay tuned. Oil I'm going to be using. You don't need to add too much of granola. So you don't need much oil on your chicken curry sauce. So right now I'm going to be adding my onion and my ginger. Then you stir. Then I'm adding my spring onion. You stir as well. I'm going to be adding the mixture of thyme, curry, turmeric, and all season powder. So as you can see, So like this, we are going to leave it to heat a little bit for like one minute. So in this scene, I have added my boneless chicken inside. So right now, I'm going to be adding the water from my chicken that I have boiled. So this is how it is. Right now I'm going to be adding the chicken to it. And I'm going to be adding my meat veg as well. Please don't forget to try this my recipe at home. Don't forget to try it. Don't forget to give me a like. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave a comment below if you try this my recipe at home. So right now we are going to leave it to steam very well for like 10 minutes. Then we are going to be adding our potato flour for thickness. Stay tuned. 
right now this is my potato flour i've mixed it so i'm going to be pouring it inside my chicken curry sauce to take in it so then you stir So I'm going to leave it to boil for steam for like five minutes. Then it's ready to go. And see, it's ready. It's look at it. It's thick and it's nice. You can eat it with rice, anything of your choice. Please don't forget to try this my recipe at home. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. If you try this my recipe at home, stay tuned. See you next time as I remain your favorite girl cheese kitchen. Do you have a lovely day ahead? Thank you.